Bridge. Looked like he was covering down low in the flats and just got past him there. We'll see if the Hornets can bounce back here on this first drive. First down and 10 for the Hornets at the 35. Austin Taylor hands this one off to Treshawn Brown. Running this one to the right side. He's got room across the 50. Down the sideline. Still chugging the legs. Oh, my goodness. Treshawn Brown all the way down to the 11-yard line. What a run by the sophomore running back. No flags. Brown, the running back, once more. Four-man rush stacking him up there in that defensive line trenches as Taylor gets the snap, hands it off to Brown, kicks it to the outside, tries to gain the edge, dives for the pylon, and he's in. Touchdown. Treshawn Brown and the Hornets take the lead, and it only took three plays to make it happen, and it was all Treshawn Brown. Big fourth down here for both of these teams. Taylor in the shotgun, gets the snap, hands it off to Brown. Flag on the play, could be a free play for the Hornets. Brown across the 30, stiffs off one man. 20, 15, 10, 5, Treshawn Brown, he takes it to the house. A 39-yard strike. There are flags on the play, but they did let this one play out, so this should stand. It's a penalty, should be against Montgomery. First and goal for the Hornets at the four. Looking to go quickly. Taylor hands it off to Brown. Jets the edge on the right side. Into the end zone. Touchdown. Treshawn Brown. He's got every score tonight for the Hornets. His third rushing touchdown of the night. And once again makes it a two-possession game. And they'll bring up third down and ten. For Huntsville at the 38-yard line. Taylor in the shotgun. Same formation with the receivers. He gets the snap. He'll roll to his right with some time. Fires this one up on a go route to Melton Green. Comes back for the ball at the 32-yard line. Flag flies in late. So that should be good for the catch and maybe tack on more yardage after that. Beautiful play by Melton Green the third. A 35-yard attempt for Joseph Mejia. Having a kick across his body. Snap by Parker is good. The hold is good by Lorenz. And the kick by Mejia is good as well. 35-yard make for Joseph Mejia. Makes it 23-10 to 10 with 4.22 left to go here in the second quarter. We make a triple package of receivers to the right side. Taylor claps, gets the snap, has some protection. Steps up in the pocket, fires to a wide open Conte at the 30-yard line. Across the 25, still going. 15, cuts it back at the 10. Savion Conte into the end zone. Flag flies in late. Touchdown for the moment, but we got to check the flag. Great run after the catch. Savion Conte. Goal on the Mocha Mocha attorneys at law, first down. Nice play by Austin Taylor, rolling to his right, throws the ball on the run. Good catch, Savion Conte. First and goal at the four. They hand it off to Brown. He's already got three tonight. Give him four. Treshawn Brown, he is into the end zone. Touchdown for the sophomore running back. He is all over it tonight. And that brings it back out to a two-possession game. The Hornets. 7-10 left to go in this ATK towing third quarter of play. Two receivers to the near side. Taylor looking to his right on the shotgun snap. He'll go with a wide open hold to the far sideline. First down and a lot more across the 40-45 as a couple of Montgomery defenders push him out of bounds. And that is well enough for another Mocha Mocha tourney at law. First down. 20. Maybe Taylor to work some play action here. Keep it on an option. Do something here. It's a long way to go. You need the seven yard line. Taylor in the shotgun once again on third down. He rolled to his right after the snap. Looking down the field, finds a sideline, gets a man, gets both feet in. What a catch on the play by Hunter Lorenz. His first one on the night. So first down and goal on the two-yard line for Huntsville. Three receivers to the far sideline. Taylor in the shotgun. He'll roll to his right. He'll keep it himself, and he will Vince Young his way into the corner of the end zone for six. And MR MRC Creekside Huntsville touchdown to extend the lead 36-20. So close. You know, and that's something that coming into this ball game, we talked about it. The Huntsville defense, yes, the offense fumbles a lot and loses a lot, but the defense as well, recovering and forcing four fumbles each. So they know how to make those turnovers, and they almost did it again right there. So Montgomery catches a break. It's a loss of four on the play, second down and 14. As, oh, a botch snap here by Montgomery. Man, oh, man, the wheels are falling off. A play here for the Hornet defense. Got them in their own territory at the 39. It's four down territory regardless, but you got to make a big stop here. Here's the pressure for the Hornets as Williams has a little bit of time staying in the pocket. Now he's flushed out, just throws this one up for a prayer, and it's intercepted. Cole Schroeder across the 40, down to the 44-yard line. Desperation by Montgomery, and Cole Schroeder snuffs it out. See, as long as they hold the offense, it'll be interesting to see what kind of crossing routes maybe you see here on this second down play. 
5.25 left to go, second and 23. Austin Taylor in the shotgun, gets the snap, hands it off to Brown, end around play, running this one to the left side and a lot of room in front of him. This is Milton Green the third, cuts it back at the 30 yard line. First down, Huntsville. Flag flies in after the play. But Brown the running back and three receivers, Conte, Green, the third and Lorenz has Taylor play action fake here. He'll throw to Hunter Lorenz. He's got a lot of room in front of him. 10, five touchdown. The best friends connect. Taylor to Lorenz and it'll put the game on ice. After this one, Williams gets the snap rolling out of the pocket with the pressure bearing down on him here. He'll throw this one again over the top and it's intercepted by, of course, the guy we don't have a roster name of, <laughs> number 35 for the Huntsville Hornets. But how about that for that young man right there? He gets an interception down the stretch of this ball game and the Hornets will take over on the interception. 